good afternoon everyone welcome back with me again okay so this time i'm here in Jimbaranhe area this is jalan raya uluwatu and as usual i will do a motor vlog and update you the situation if you uh, would like to go to uluwatu temple or gwk which is garuda which is in china you will pass by this street or you can stay around in this area as well because there are so many uh, accommodations that you can stay and here on the left side this is the new mall last time i showed you inside now they had everything here it is sidewalk jimbaran a lot of restaurants and they have supermarket of course cinema for you that like to watch movie you can go here and if you like to try street food there are so many around in this area guys it is a bit uh, how to say different view eh? if you compare then Seminyak or Kuta area, you will see a lot of people or shops selling uh, souvenirs or there are so many bars in this area, still uh, a lot of local businesses. And here on the right side, this is my favorite supermarket to go if I need to do uh, to buy my daily meat or many things actually from this supermarket, we call it Flandis. So if you are staying around in this area, you need to do a lot of shopping, you can go there. And maybe next time I will show you what they have inside, yeah? So that if you are staying around in this area, you know what to expect when you go to that supermarket. And here you will see some restaurant like this one, for example, Bobby Gulling. The next one, they have a few more restaurants that you can go. Well, this one is also another Babi Guling, guys. There are so many Babi Guling, but this one looks closed. And here, what is this? Crab Restaurant? King's Crab Ocean Resto. So you can come here. And they have Padma Sari. What is this? New hotel, I think. Wow, quite big also. Maybe you can stay here next time. Anyway, I will go to the beach as well to see. Uh, the situations at Moya Beach, which is Jimbaran Beach, where a lot of tourists like to have their uh, seafood dinner, and hopefully today we can see sunset. There was sun earlier, but suddenly cloudy again, so it's really hard to predict the weather nowadays, guys, in Bali. This is another warung or restaurant, Iga, where they sell the ribs, and this one, I think, it's a Japanese restaurant. Right? You. and this is quite famous Temple Hill resident uh, by the way talking about beach I've been to a few beaches in Bali since we got like uh, rain on and off from the last few days so been to uh, Seminyak it was I mean Kuta it was uh, not really good and also last time I went to Kadonganan which is the um, seafood area as well it was dirty too but let's see today at Jimbaran if it's uh, better or not I saw last time about Jimbaran beach at a social media like Facebook or Instagram it was dirty and it's not really good it's really sad actually this thing happened like every year every raining season a lot of trust on the beach let's see Jimbaran hopefully the beach uh, have uh, cleaned already and here also you will see some restaurants oh, it's nice to see some tourists walking around here on the left side they have small cafe there and also here very nice to see that And here they have Le Osteria in Ubud. I think maybe the same owner, yeah. the same name, Le Osteria. But in Ubud, it was so busy all the time. I came to Ubud and it was so busy. And this is Indian Kangur. If you love Indian food, you can come here. And here I will go to the left and let's go to the beach, guys. Well, look at this on the right side. There's a cafe also. And here is the Kupu Kupu Jimbaran Hotel, guys. This hotel uh, was closed quite a long time during COVID-19. But glad to see now they are open. But this place, I think, still closed, yeah? And 
here on the right side, Moya Beach Shoppy. Oh, they have nice stuff here. Pizza, crepes, and a lot of uh, small businesses in this area. And there in the front is the Bull's Head Cafe or bar. So, like to come here, maybe? There are some tourists enjoying their time here. People are having like early dinner. Eh? And here is the steakhouse, guys. Now it's around 6 o'clock. It is sunset time actually. So let's see if you can see a little bit of sunset. And this is La Meridian. You planning to stay here? Last time I came to this hotel, it was a nice hotel anyway. Uh, they had like they have like a private pool, but they have their main pool as well. So for you that uh, stay at the regular room, you can uh, swim at their uh, main pool, which is big pool. And here on the right side, this is the Baliku. Wow. It's a really bad situation. So last time I came inside and it was closed. And I think this time also still closed. It's a big area actually. It's sad to see they are closed. Okay, so this time I will show you or I will pass by a lot of cafes here in Jimbaran. And here where you can go for your seafood dinner there are so many cafes here which one is the best you can check the reviews online you can choose your seafood in front of uh, the area here and then you can sit on the beach guys this cafe is quite famous monega cafe but recently uh, i received quite a lot of complaint yeah because the service is low or something like that but Sometimes it happens when it's busy. There's all our cafes in this area. Okay, I'll park my scooter and let's walk around. This is Bali Mare Bagus Cafe. And where you can have your seafood. Look at this, they have nice setup here. Hopefully it will not rain soon. It is very cloudy and there is no sunset unfortunately because it's covered by the cloud. And these are all the cafes in this area. And let's walk around guys. And in this area as you can see the beach is quite okay. I mean it's much much better now. Still we can see a uh, few plastics or garbages but very less it is much much better compared than last time i saw on the social media it was so dirty and now it's considered quite okay guys so hopefully this beach will get cleaned faster so that people can enjoy more let's walk around here and let's enjoy the atmosphere and this is monega cafe very busy. I think one of the busiest here. Yeah? Busiest cafe. And if you like to do horse riding, there are two horses here available. There are some cafes are still empty, so this is what is happening during a uh, low season. And hopefully it will be uh, getting busier next month. And this is Akusuka Bali Beach side restaurant guys. This is quite uh, famous as well here. And uh, this one, I think last time someone asked me if it's pizza outlet still open here in Zimbara. Maybe this one, yeah. It is Pizza Beach. GWB Pizza Beach Finally, we can see a little bit of sunset and as you can see there are some people doing surfing 
I think maybe it is a good time to do surfing now. This is where I like to sit when I come to this beach with my daughter. So if you don't want to eat seafood, you can simply sit here. You can buy some uh, drinks, coconuts or just mineral water and then you can sit in the chairs here guys. It's a nice area as well. You still can enjoy the view of sunset. And right there, there is a beach club but still very quiet. And I think this beach club, uh, I never heard any music here played, which is good. And most of the time when there is a beach club, it will be like uh, with loud music, guys. But this one is okay. And here on the left side, this is part of the Sundara Resort, I think. And they have kind of like events still ongoing. I'm not really sure what, but they have the stage, they will have music. Maybe waiting, maybe. So what do you think about this area guys? Would you like to stay in Jimbaran area maybe? Okay everyone, that's all for today's video from this area. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to support me by subscribing to this channel. See you again in the next video. Thank you very much and bye now.